Mr. Lucky Ajegboye said trouble started when they intended to orchestrate some evil deeds against a non-indigent, one Mr. Bayo, and want him to be part of the plot, adding that he however declined. He said his refusal was the beginning of his problems. He said ever since they have been oppressing him, burnt his property, beating him up, and confiscated some of his properties. He said the trauma of being homeless for a long time is seriously affecting his general well-being. Mr. Ajegboye said he had sought from security agency without success. Hence, he decided to approach his father, the Oba of Benin, Omon Oba Nedu Ukwak Polokpolo, Oba Ewai II for justice. The agency, the community headed by Samuel Ibnobaro, they have been oppressing me since 2014 because I have refused to join them in doing evil. The evil is that they, they wanted to take over one man's uh, property, one man called Adebayo. Ajitina Maruf to take over his property and I refused. Oba invited them to come to the palace because of this matter. When the, when the Adeba of Mata came to the palace to settle the matter, my community refused to honor the palace. And because of this matter, my house was set ablaze. Until now, nothing was done. That is why I said, let me cry to our, high, our royal father. Chief Stanley Obawi, a city of Benin who led the delegation to receive him, told him that since his petition has been carefully spelled out, it will be presented to His Royal Majesty Oba Benin and Monoba Nedu Ukwa Kolokolo Oba Ewai the second for necessary action. He assured him that he will be summoned at the appropriate time. Reacting on behalf of Samuel Ignawaru, who was fingered in the petition, the Enogi of Egbeta, His Royal Highness Andrew Ignogun said there was no altar of truth in the allegation. The Enogi who spoke in a telephone interview said nobody threatened the life of Mr. Lucky Adeboye, but was the fight between two Yoruba factions that led to the burning of his house as a form of repressive attack. The first allegation, because uh, what really happened is that, as in supporting that Yoruba man, there are two guns, one of them called Bayo, drove the other side away from that land. So in the course of their fighting, he is supporting him, that is why they burned down his house. Mr. Lucky Adeboye has vowed to pursue his cause to logical conclusion until he gets justice from those oppressing him. A Fosa 